what is up everyone this is Karen here welcome back to tech Karen youtube channel this one is the update of miui razor edition for the poco x3 users in my case this one is a miui 12.0.8 stable version based on xiaomi eu where we have a little bit of extra changes which i'm going to share with you it is a kind of a fixed update which some issues were reported in the previous build which are now fixed in this update first of all this brightness slider there was a color which was not even changeable and was not looking good but now we have fixed this one we have the white brightness lighter color and also the ascent color is fixed there's no dark maroon color anywhere the whole normal color is everywhere which is fixed and working perfectly fine if we're looking for some other things we have a some new text written there like join support razor official group and razor or os official updates channel both of these things are available and including that we have the miui gestures like the horizontal gestures horizontal recents but the ios recents are removed which were laggy of course those were lagging your device the multitasking was not good as you can see and includes the floating windows so yes the miui launcher is present there which is quite good the poco launcher is still there also but menu launcher is the default one with that navigation bar pill and if you talk about the series bar icons these are also changed and these are same like the previous updates so no complaints here and nothing else to talk about but if you're looking for some other things for example if you move on to the settings let me show you by going into lock screen here the always on display is removed it's not there and also some users were reporting ads it's lcd display so the always on display don't use that and it will just break your device so we just removed that one also so actually some things some features that which were reported are, are, are removed from here and including that the refresh rate also the 90 hertz was not actually working but that was working too but that's not default and some users were not able to use that so we've removed that one also other things if you're looking for the features etc are same as i previously told you but yes it's based on version 10 with the february security patch and based on the latest update menu 12.0.8 stable version and the kernel version is also changed previous time there was a dpa kernel but right now we have the default kernel we just wanted to give you the default experience and see the smoothness also including that but yes you can also change the custom kernel you can simply change the kernel if you want to password security the asin color is working perfectly fine the previous time the asin color was kind of an issue but that is fixed the notch was also the issue which is also fixed in this update and like that full screen display where we have the full screen gestures where you can simply see this navigation bar pill and swipe up from the corner for the google assistant all the main things are fixed here all the basic things are working looking quite impressive on fonts themes kind of the same thing which is quite impressive honestly you can give it a try this room is quite good for the poco x3 user if you're looking to install this build the installation is same if you are encrypted this needs format data you can try it flashing permissive or you can try flashing matches and it's easy to install it will boot up on a device without any issues also in developer options you have the option to change these ascent colors which are actually working in the previous update these were not working actually these were working but that maroon color was not even changing but that maroon color is now removed and as you can see we have these options where we have just changed this color and like this you'll be able to change all the colors present on your device right now which are changeable and working perfectly fine if you're looking for the themes yes it has all those extra themes options and fonts options are also available as you can see these fonts are quite good and proxima soft font is one of my favorite ones so i applied that one you can try out Mar Merlo new round which is also one of my favorite one and google sense is all time favorite you can try out that font also it's just up to you we have the google sense mode option available you can simply try it out on your device if you want to arista pro including that we have some dynamic wallpapers let me show you that which is a dynamic wallpaper i was talking about this is the new dynamic wallpaper which is looking quite good these were wallpapers we had previously but now we have this kind of new wallpaper other wallpapers are same here which you already know about gamer static wallpapers which you can try it out these were the things i just wanted to let you know a simple and new update for the poco x3 users if you want to install this build link is in the description this is all for today's video thanks for watching and goodbye have a nice day